peace infinite waters diving deep once again beautiful deep divers we are out here in the heart of nature baby but do you have a desire a burning desire to be with someone like those lovebirds up there but you're lonely right now lonely you're single right now but not only that you feel so lonely i just want someone right now ralph how to deal with your loneliness when you desire to be with someone let's just whoa breathing in that good ass prana baby that's the question that came in let me read the question if you've got a question you can add me you can add me on instagram at infinite waters someone asked ralph yes for a long time i've been single but it's worse ralph tell me i deal with immense loneliness at the same time, I desire to be with someone right now, Ralph. Please help. I love your videos. Thank you for inspiring millions. Deep divers. We got a whole lot to talk about. This is sexology. Water, fire, hot, cold, yin, yang. Daddy's home. We're back. Now, I know what it's like when you're alone. You're lonely and you just want someone to hug you at night. And not even the cat down the road is by your side and we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Announcements. Once again, if you've got a question, add me on Instagram right now at Infinite Waters. These people get selected first and foremost, as well as people on the website, ralphsmart.com. Shout out to everybody who's been getting the merch, the good ass Prana shirts ralphsmart.com slash clothes and i'm actually going to start featuring people in the videos who have the good ass prana shirts now let's talk about it you see a lot of people on the planet are lonely a lot of people on the planet live in a house all alone they come home to an empty room no one there to say, how was your day? How are you doing, right? I know what it's like, but I'm gonna tell you what transformed my life to attract an amazing being. And I'm always attracting amazing beings to me. You see, it starts with this. In your mind, you're probably telling yourself, be with someone who makes you happy right now. That's fantastic. We all want someone that's going to make us happy. But take away the with and then be someone who makes you happy. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. You see, because you can't depend on people to bring you happiness. If they do, that's great. If they don't, what are you going to do? You can't expect someone to love you, to give you the love you need. You have to start loving yourself 100%. You see, I don't have to worry about attracting a twin flame because I'm in alignment with who I am. So it naturally comes. When you are in alignment with the truth of who you are, you will naturally attract everyone to you that is supposed to be in your life. You see, whoever is supposed to be in your life will always be there the moment you are in alignment. If you're single and unhappy, because there are many single people who are so happy, they're like, yes, I can finally come home on time. I can finally come home without a curfew. I can finally do what I want to, right? But there are a lot of people who are desiring to be with someone special. And I will tell you, the greatest relationship you can have is with yourself. You have to be someone who makes you happy. You have to learn how to fill your cup. I'm just making these videos solo. At the same time, I got over 1 million subscribers. Just imagine the kinds of messages I get every single day. Exactly. So that's only because I'm in alignment. That's very desirable. We are attracted to people who are in alignment because it shows these people 
have mental strength and emotional strength. But I want someone, Ralph. I want them right now. Ever notice this, deep divers? The more you want someone, the more they don't come. Why? Because along my early journey, when I was like 16, really wanting to go out with that girl, saying, please go out with me. Like, the reason why I didn't attract it was because I wasn't in my true purpose. Right now, it's crazy. The amazing people I'm meeting every single day. I don't have to worry about love. Love comes to you when you are in your purpose. I don't focus on, hey, I've got to find someone right now. No, it's already here because I'm in 100% alignment. So stop worrying about trying to meet someone that's going <laughs> to wipe away all your tears. No. Start today by making a vow to yourself that as long as I am in my highest purpose, I will attract someone special to me. It doesn't mean you have to be passive. Of course, approach people. But I'm telling you from personal experience. It's what I call men of purpose and women of purpose. Why do women like men in uniform? Because it shows he's about his business. Slow motion this side. Mm. It shows he's a warrior. It shows that he can provide for the children. So many times, all of that energy you're spending on wanting someone, fellas, ladies, you can use that energy on cultivating inner harmony and balance. I don't have to worry about anything, right? Because abundance is coming in many different directions. So for the first time in your life, start, instead of seeking outside, start seeking inside. Get to know the real you. Have a conversation with yourself and say, actually, maybe, just maybe, it's time to love myself a little bit more. Because nobody, is going to give you the love and attention you need beside yourself. Only you can do that. Right? Growing up, I used to play by myself. My mom was like, gosh, you're so happy and content. I'm a full cup. And that's why when you become whole, you will now start to see your reflection. And then you dance off into the sunset. So, the moment you realize wanting nothing of someone else will actually attract them to you. When you learn how to cultivate internal happiness, joy, and serenity, another person will come along and amplify it. Many times, we haven't worked on ourselves. For a long time, deep divers, I didn't work on myself. I was lazy. And I'm like, I just expect to meet someone that's going to sweep me off my feet. <clears throat> it wasn't going to happen like that. Why? Because I wasn't working on myself. You see, fellas are attracted to women who are working on themselves. Same thing. Okay, women, you love guys who are working on themselves. In other words, cultivating inner peace and balance. Because if someone is not working on themselves, mastering their emotions, it means that they won't be able to take care of us. Right? So, become better to attract better. Slow motion this side. Mm. Say it again, Ralph. Become better to attract better, okay? When I was just so desperately seeking, desiring someone special, it wasn't happening because I wasn't working on who I am. Right now, because I'm in alignment, helping millions of people, it just arrives at my doorstep. Oh, thanks. Because... 
I worked on myself, now I'm helping other people work on themselves. So forget about trying to meet someone right now. My message to you is to go on a retreat. Go on a retreat. Spend time alone. You see, many people who are single need to be alone because you need to know thyself before you can be with someone else. That's why there's so many relationship problems all around the world. I get thousands of messages every single day. Ralph, tell me, my relationship is terrible because this person is never there because they don't know themselves. If they knew themselves, they would have known what they were signing up for. So that's why to become better, you have to work on yourself every single day. Become better to attract better, okay? Timing is everything. Many times, it's not our time yet. You see, just because it's not happening for you right now, it doesn't mean you're not gonna find someone special. You gotta start realizing it could happen for you in three years, in four years, okay? Go and talk to your aunties and uncles. Say, oh, when did you meet your partner? They'll tell you, oh, when I was like 37, huh? So what happened before that point? Well, that's another story, right? So you gotta be patient. You have to be patient. Even if you are lonely and single and desiring someone to give you a hug at night, be patient, be willing to be patient because a lot of people settle and they're unhappy they're unhappy about their relationships they tell me about it so don't settle by being patient and knowing your true worth but i don't want to be alone ralph well it's better to be alone than in a relationship and miserable mm. slow motion this side mm. Woo. Breathing in that good-ass prana, baby. How to deal <clears throat> with your loneliness when you desire to be with someone special. Deep divers. When we talk of waking up every single day, what is the first thing that comes into your mind? Are you waiting for someone to love you? Or are you about being purposeful? Because when you are purposeful, you will have more love to give. And that's how to deal with loneliness when you are desiring to be with someone. I'm asking you today, Deep Divers, to be purposeful. And the more purposeful you become, you will meet someone special, a soulmate, even your twin flame, because they have seen you in your true authenticity. Slow motion this side. Mm. It happened to me along my journey. I've been making videos a long time. Can you imagine how many amazing people I've met? Can you imagine how many amazing people I've met? Exactly. So, if you want in your purpose, if you're feeling sorry for yourself, how can people really see you in your highest nature? People have to love your flaws, but also they've got to love your light and your shine as well as your darkness. They've got to love all of it. And that can only happen when you are really in the process of becoming your greatest version. So get up today, start living your dream, start really realizing that when you are in alignment, you will meet someone special who's also doing a similar thing to you. They share the same values as you, okay? How to deal with your loneliness when you desire to be with someone. Deep divers, listen very carefully. Listen very carefully. <laughs> this is where it gets fun. Sometimes it's good to be lonely. I was happy being alone and single, okay? <laughs> Many years ago, why? Because I'm like, there is nobody I can find that is a vegan. Because when I st I've been a vegan for over 13 years. When I started on a plant-based diet, it wasn't that popular. Now, because I'm inspiring millions, it's getting a lot more popular. But when I was starting, 
like everyone I was interested in, they weren't vegan. And I would be trying to convince them, hey, go vegan. And I would force the relationship and I would still feel alone. That's why I always say, it's better to be lonely, alone and happy, than in a relationship and miserable. So when I actually was like, actually, I'm going to accept being single. I'm going to embrace this me time, this alone time. And guess what happened? I was like, whoa, it feels so good to be alive, baby. And then someone magically appeared. Because sometimes it's better to wait that little bit longer than to than to settle, than to settle, okay? It's better to wait that little bit longer than to settle. Many times when we are talking about loneliness, and shout out to everybody doing the 7-Day Vegan Challenge, Instagram at Infinite Waters, add me there, I want to hear your journey. Many people who are lonely are not desirable to themselves. Law of Attraction states we never attract what we want, we always attract what we are. So, it happened to me along my journey. I became a vegan, I attracted a vegan. Okay? But also because I'm desirable to myself. When was the last time you practiced self-care? If you are practicing self-care, your loneliness disappears because now you actually have a good relationship with yourself. And then, if someone comes, that's great. If they don't come, no problem. Because you love yourself. That's all that matters. Right? So, be desirable to yourself. Ladies say, oh, I'm so fine. Fellas say the same thing. Be desirable to yourself. And you can only do that through authenticity. Nothing is sexier than authenticity. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. How to deal with loneliness when you desire to be with someone else. Be available. I counsel a lot of people over the years, thousands. And a lot of these people sometimes have got this fabulous life, fabulous profile, but they're very lonely. Why are they alone? Because they've never made any time for a relationship. Let me repeat that. Why are they alone? Because they've never made any time for a relationship. So you have to make yourself available. If you are lonely right now, chances are you're not making love a top priority. You're not putting in the effort to go out and meet someone. You're waiting for everybody to come to you. Okay, because when you are whole, you actively seek other people because you have that confidence in yourself. Okay, because a lot of people who are very lonely, you lose that confidence and you expect people just to come along and make you happy. You have to learn how to fill your own cup. And once you have that cup brimming over, if you see your reflection, you're just like, hey, let's go out. Let's go out and eat. Ralph Smart is making some good ass vegan food, <laughs> right? So learn to be available. Many of us, we're not available to even brush our teeth. <laughs> we're not available to really love someone. We're caught up. We are preoccupied, working every single day and no time to cultivate the love energy. That's why I'm my own boss because I've made time for love. That's why I'm never lonely. I'm my own CEO. I'm my own boss, right? So you have to realize that maybe you've got to start putting your priorities right. What is most important? Is it just slaving away at work or is it actually investing? Because love is also a great investment. Investing in loving someone else and sharing your life with them. Many times we are lonely and single when we are really desperately desiring to be with someone because many times we've forgotten that we are fabulous. Deep divers, I'm here to tell you, you are enough. A lot of you don't realize that today. 
but I'm here to tell you, you are enough. When I realized I was enough, other people believed it. Other people will see it. You see, if you aren't rooting for you, how can you expect me to root for you? I will root for you because I'm a Pisces. I'm kind like that, but not everyone else will. That's why people who really love themselves, they've got this energy about themselves, like the cat down the road, automatically you love them too. Because it shows that this person has really found the magic within themselves. So start finding your inner shine, what I call outer beauty and inner shine. How to deal with loneliness when you desire to be with someone special. Be willing to give. Be willing to give. Be willing to appreciate. Be willing to be thankful. Many times, a lot of people who are alone, they take people for granted. I always see that people, especially even deep divers, a lot of them are, you beautiful deep divers are very grateful. But some people aren't grateful. And I always say that will reflect into your relationship. When you are showing a lot, when, when you are showing, when you are showing a lack of gratitude, that person will walk away eventually if they know their true worth. That's why you gotta be grateful for people who you are connecting with. You have to be grateful for people you are connecting with every single day. Don't take people for granted. Otherwise, you will end up alone, lonely and single. So start to pay people compliments. Start to pay people compliments. Start to show people appreciation and start to give freely. Love can become a gamble. But if you don't give freely, if you don't really open up yourself to someone else and be vulnerable, even though you are feeling lonely, you'll never really meet your true reflection. You will never really meet your true reflection because you gotta open up 100%. Say, actually, I just love you. Like, tell that person, don't try and play games. A lot of people who are lonely are playing games, too many games. I'm not gonna text because I don't do that. <laughs> then you're not really ready to meet someone special. You gotta be able to become vulnerable and express your true feelings and emotions to that person. How to deal with loneliness, your loneliness, when you desire to be with someone. Learn this deep divers. Prepare yourself. Every single day, prepare yourself for that person. If they're not here yet, that's good. It means there's even more time for you to work on yourself so you have so much more to give them. Mm. What? Slow, mo slow motion this side, baby. Mm. Okay. You find the one you love doing what you love. Every single day I'm sharing. And in return, I attract someone special. I attract someone special. It also comes from allowing yourself to be seen. Men stop being macho men. Ladies also learn to surrender. Everyone's got to surrender. I've got to even learn how to surrender more and more because only through true surrender can love manifest. Let me repeat that. Only through, only through true surrender can love manifest. So surrender today. Open yourself to other people. Be available. Love yourself. And be patient. The love you want will find you when you find yourself. Stop looking for your soulmate and start connecting with your soulmate and then just say, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? Beautiful deep divers, you are amazing. Life is good. We're just woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Have a beautiful day, deep divers. Infinite waters, diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy. Peace. You. If you want your question featured on Infinite Waters like this person, 
pull out your phone and add me on Instagram at Infinite Waters right now. Shout out to everybody who's been getting the merch. RalphSmart.com slash clothes. Good ass Prana shirts. Just remind yourself. You find the one you love doing what you love. <laughs>